Cambodia's Prime Minister Hun Sen greets as he holds a ceremony at the Angkor Wat Temple to pray for peace and stability in Cambodia, in Siem Reap Province, Cambodia December. 3, 2017. Source Reuters Samrang Pring Cambodia's government on Thursday called on the United States to reconsider visa restrictions imposed in response to Prime Minister Hun Sen's ongoing crackdown against political opponents and freedom of expression. As reported by Radio Free Asia, ruling Cambodian People's Party CPP spokesperson Sok Kiwai Sam called on the U.S. to rethink the restrictions, accusing the State Department of having double standards by contradicting what he called U.S. President Donald Trump's policy of non-interference in the affairs of sovereign states. See also U.S. imposes travel restrictions for those undermining democracy in Cambodia. It affects our feelings, and the U.S. government should reconsider this issue, because Cambodia is a tiny country that doesn't possess even tiny missiles, let alone nuclear weapons, he said. Therefore, we request this superpower country to kindly permit tiny Cambodia to live in peace. His remarks follow a statement Wednesday from the U.S. State Department announcing visa restrictions on individuals it said were involved in undermining democracy in Cambodia at state depths box in direct response to the Cambodian government's series of anti-democratic actions, we announced the Secretary of State will restrict entry into the United States of those individuals involved in undermining democracy in Cambodia. https://t.cows.in5zkfbpic.twitter.com ni 43f5 ab Department of State at State Dept December 6, 2017 Hun Sen's government must reverse course by reinstating the political opposition, releasing Kem Soka, and allowing civil society and media to resume their constitutionally protected activities, if they want the travel restrictions to be lifted, the statement said. See also China boosts investment in Cambodia amid crackdown on democracy in November. The Cambodian Supreme Court dissolved the only credible opposition party in the country. Two months prior, opposition leader Kem Soka was arrested on charges of treason. He remains in jail awaiting trial. Hun Sen's government has also overseen a crackdown on press freedom, shuttered organizations that voice anti-government sentiment, and closed U.S.-funded NGOs. Sok Hee San accused the U.S. of using its influence to put pressure on Cambodia on behalf of the opposition party, according to RFA, referencing accusations that Kem Sokka had colluded with Washington to bring down the CPP, which the U.S. Embassy has denied. He said the CPP had made great efforts to build Cambodia into a country that truly respects democratic principles, and that the party's actions against political opponents and organizations were simply meant to reinforce the rule of law. Topics. Covered Cambodia Democracy Hun Sen United States Visa Restrictions.